the only thing that's different is I don't have the jerk seasoning that I usually use. So my husband went and picked uh, this one up. Not sure how it tastes. So I'm going to add some other stuff to it. Um, I have jalapeno to make it a little spicier. I have sugar, scallions, I have onion and ginger soy sauce and a little browning and that's the um chicken seasoning or what it says marinade so that's what that is so what i'll do is i'm going to put some of it in the food processor and then i'm going to put it on the chicken and i'm going to let it stay there and marinate before i put it in the oven for about a half hour and i'm not really using any salt and other seasoning because the um, soy sauce have salt in it and the browning have salt in it and I'm sure the marinade have salt in it. So everything has salt in it. So I don't want it to be salty. All right, so let's get started with this. And the chicken is already cleaned and everything is pretty much prepped. The easiest way, that's what I'm going for. So I'm only going to put some because I like to have it on the chicken, I love the color and everything with everything. And even though it's gonna cook with it, I'm just gonna put some of it. Same goes for the jalapeno. I'm not gonna use all of it because I don't want it to be too spicy where you're not able to eat it. Or when my family's not able to eat it, I'll eat spice, it doesn't bother me. And I'm just gonna put a little. And it's all going to be mixed in with the marinade. Let's get some onion. I love having onions in the pot. And you go in here. And I did wash my hands. It's just easier. And this is um, ginger, so I'm just putting some in there. And go ahead. And this is less than a quarter cup of sugar. It's not that much sugar. Just think a little sweetness to it will make it tastes really good. Now, if you have the right jerk seasoning, you don't have to add the jalapenos. Um, when you do the jerk chicken, you they use scotch bonnet pepper. I don't have that either. So, I just use what I have in the house instead of buying something I don't want too much browning. Just a little to give the chicken color. And being that it's chicken breast, comes out. First time trying it. I'm just going to put it all over the chicken and I'll show you some finish. Don't waste, don't want to waste any of it. This is what it looks like. And my oven is already preheated. So I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna use my hands today. 
There's a lot of marinade in here, so I think I might, I'm going to put some um, garlic powder. I have some paprika as well. I'm going to add some of that. Did I say paprika? Cayenne pepper. Don't know why I said paprika. Then I have garlic. to put the rest of the scallion in there. And onions. And I will put more onions when it's almost done. I'm just going to add the rest. Hmm. I think it's going to be really spicy. I think I'm going to add some, um, a little more brown in. Just for the color. All right, so it is ready. I'm going to go ahead and put it in the oven for about half hour. Then I'm going to come back and check it. And the chicken breasts that I use, I slice them so it's not as thick, so it won't take as long to cook. It's about an hour later, um, my second time checking the chicken. And it's almost done. Um, it's cooked, but I wanted to get some more color. As you can see, the reason why I use the, um, the browning, because the chicken breast is gonna be white and as you can tell so I'm just gonna cook it in here a little bit more now usually I would dump it all out but because I'm making sandwiches with it I don't want it to be dry I don't want it to really dry out so I'm just gonna put a little seasoning salt on top of it and some black pepper And then the rest of the onions that I had that I said I was going to put, I'm going to go ahead and add that in. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to just put it back in the oven. I'm not going to cover it this time. The chicken is ready. It's about 15 minutes. It's nice and soft. And I already have um, some romaine, lettuce, and tomatoes ready for our sandwich. And I'll put it, to put it together and then I'll show you what it looks like. 